will be the wrong one. The ones that have swag, the Yahoo Yahoo boys, as my son would say. These, in short, are the role models that they are looking at. These are the ones who reinforce negative societal behaviors and values. This is a travesty of an unfolding tragedy for us. Why have I spent the time talking about fatherless homes and the impact that it has on our children? Well, the truth of the matter is that an irresponsible boy tends to become an irresponsible man. And it is therefore a vicious cycle. If you plant cocoyam, you cannot harvest plantain. It affects not only our homes and our culture, our cultural and traditional values and structure, but it permeates but it permeates the very strength of our regional economy as well. The consistent hard work and mental vigor needed to build a solid regional economic base in the Niger Delta becomes completely eroded. And once our economic base is eroded, we become, as a group, less significant in relation to our country's national discourse. There are no shortcuts to working your way up the ladder of life. Progressing in life, in work, and in relationships, marital or otherwise, is always dependent on consistent effort and on hard work. As we create more responsible young men and women, we will generate, we will generate more responsible fathers, which in turn will engender a more sustainable society and build a greater nation of successful Ijo men and women. And to do this, we need to go back to the fundamentals. We need to focus inwards and recreate the strong family bonds centered around